is man that thou art mindful of? And I've made him lower, a little bit lower, little, 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 lower than Elohim. Other scriptures say angels. Every one of you here has an angel. Everyone. There is nobody here that is angelless or without an angel. Some people will die and never see their angel. And you are supposed to encounter them. They are called ministering spirits. They, they are created for one thing around you. To minister to you. God cannot be inside and his angels are not inside. Angels are not too far from you. Your life is a world of his own. Angels are messengers. Let me give you some few revelations about angels. I had opportunities in my life to meet with angels, encounter angels. In dreams, physically, yes. And I have seen that there is a dimension of angelic movement. Oh God. Oh yeah, la, 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 la. During the anniversary, we had a fire heartbreak that nobody knew around the other side there. Not electrical, just a mistake of some few workers. And it was off to the ceiling. And it was very serious. Very serious. That we had the fire, water, water, uh, fire service. They came here about how many of them? Two. More, there are more that were coming. And, and it was serious. The way the fire. The whole of this place was full of smoke and everywhere. Everybody were panicking that. And then the fire quenched. It is so mysterious. So when they came, the, the, the whole thing was already under control. But I, what I saw physically, those who are here know what I'm saying. It, it was beyond explanation because it was terrible. I was a little bit worried because I knew it was not the rubber and drop of cup of water that quenched that kind of fire. Then I went home. I slept. I shared with mama. I was in this assembly here. I came in and I walked to the place where the fire started. And I got there. I saw an angelic being. The wings were so big. Very big. Very big. The angel was like and fear listen to me. Fear gripped me. And he said to me, you did not know what your father did. I, I, I used to love it when angels communicate with me and they don't tell me he's my God. They tell me your father. See, you don't know what your father did. They said to me, he said to me, I mean, he said the fire was up to that place. The assignment was to blow off the whole roof. It was a demonic assignment. He said, I stood here and I did my wings like and I saw he said the wind from my wings which the fire at once what you saw as smoke already and he gave me the angel told me that the fire was already on for 30 minutes that nobody knew and I've seen angels, but I never knew. The wings of these angels were like metal. The strength of the wind was so much that I woke up, I was feeling 
the noise of the wind, of just swinging the wind. Whoop. You don't know. You don't know what power we have as believers. You don't know the strength and energy we have as believers. We are spirit being, and there is a presence. They that are with us are more than they that are against us. Life in the spirit is real. Hey, God is not a scam. No, no, no. If you see a man that is helped by God, his glory is all over him. It's a man that have met God, that have encountered God, that have met God at better. I've wrestled. My bones might be broken, but I will not let you go unless you bless me. Life of the Spirit. I don't want to leave this earth an ordinary man. I don't want to be a prophet that is ordinary. Some of you, your sensual knowledge has killed your partnership with God. You are with me in one room. In one room. Together with me. All the things that are... Give him the mic. All the things that are happening now. You, Moses. All the things that are happening now. I remember. I told you so many prophecies. Of what is happening now. Yes, sir. And I had. Had no money. No car. No bike. And I was prophesying these days now. No car. No money. No television. Nobody know me. But in one room apartment, I was telling him about the future. Moses met me. He kept your barack. I was looking for under step to sleep. Abi? Yes, sir. That's where he met me. Stranded. You think this thing is gongomi and manipulation? Hey! Some of you don't know where we are coming from. I am like this, oh. Some of you young pastors, just one car. Your brain is upside down. I have been preaching like this this 35 years going now. And my voice had not died. My passion for God had not died. Money or no money. He's alive. He's alive. He's alive. He's alive. He's alive. He's alive. Our motivation is not car. It's not money. It's the spirit of God. I have traveled everywhere. I am not moved by overseas connection. I'm moved by God. Days that there were no food, we preach like this. Days that we don't know what to do about us, rent, we preach like this. I had situation, I had to climb the altar and keep my stomach on the pulpit. And the thing is poster. The thing is another level. I am supporting my stomach because of hunger. Hey! Where is the fire? Why has the fire died? Where is the fire on the altar? Ah! Where are the buildings? Where are the ancient landmark? We are the days of compassion. We are the days of fire. We are the days of grace. What is happening to the end time believer? The wood is there. The fire is not there. The woods are not dry. The fire on the altar has died. Eli! Your children are eating seed of abomination. Hear me! The Holy Ghost is looking for a man. Uh, oh yeah. When I started having experience of angels, I st stumbled to a book, Angels on Assignment, because I could not understand. I thought I was running mental. Oh, I will enter a room. 
and I will see smoke. I'll see blue cloud. And after some time, an angelic being, I felt I was running mad. And I started reading the book, Angel on Assignment. And I discovered angels are ministering spirit and the work. Some of us here yeah, put knife on our neck. We can never go back. We are sold as a slave to Jesus. Ah! Jesus. May I not die without encountering you, Lord. Ah! When you get to heaven and God begins to show you how many times your angels were seeking your attention, but you were too busy in the flesh to pick. <laughs>